In this video, I'm going to show you how to play Nintendo 64 games on your Wii for free. All you need for this tutorial is a homebrewed Wii. If you haven't done that, I'll link a playlist in the description you can check out. You'll need your USB drive or SD card that you use to homebrew. I'm using a USB drive. And you'll need a computer with an extraction software. I use WinRAR. It's free and it works great. So getting right into it, go to the first link in the description and just click on the zip file here, the mupin mupin64 and it should download your file and open it up when it's downloaded and then we'll just open up our storage device I'm using a USB drive you could be using an SD card it doesn't matter whatever one you're using and we're just gonna drag we want not 64 and apps and we're just gonna drag those two onto the root of our my USB drive in my case and then when that's done you should be able to go into your apps and see not 64 and should have these three files and then back on the root you should have a folder that's also not 64 and it should have ROMs and saves ROMs is where we're gonna put our games if you'd like to know how to get games just type in vims and uh, go to that link and you can download your ROMs but you didn't hear that from me I don't condone piracy <laughs> this video is for educational purposes only <laughs> once you have your ROMs I have a few in here your ROMs can't be a zip file so just right click it and press extract here and once you've extracted them you can delete the zip files you don't want to keep those on there it could confuse the emulator so mupin64 plus it just stayed on there it's tiny I'm gonna leave it and your ROM should look like this Z64 and I believe the other format is N64 so once you've double checked that you're ready to eject the USB drive or SD card and I'll meet you on the Wii. We're on the Wii now and in previous videos we have channel installers for the Game Boy, NES, SNES but the N64 is a little different it's like Nintendo you have to install a WAD so I might make a video on that separately in the future but once you're on your home menu just go to the homebrew channel start it up and then you're gonna click on not 64 load it up sometimes it takes a little bit to load do not fret and here we go now before you play any games I do suggest you go into the settings and double check that your save state device is on whichever type you're using so I have a USB drive which is fat 32 so I it is on fat so I'm just gonna double check that it's the save devices are on USB you can press B to go back to the main menu and then to play the game just load up a ROM and mine are on my USB drive so I'll select fat and here we go we have the ROMs so let's uh, let's just load up Donkey Kong now right now it feels like it's frozen but it's not so if that happens to you and you get concerned just give it a second Emulators aren't always perfect or fast, but they're free, so can't complain. And now it's loaded, so press OK. And then, as you can see, it says Donkey Kong here, auto save enabled, and just click play, play game. Sorry, and we'll see if it works. Okay. All right. I'm not gonna lie, I have never played Nintendo 64, but I was always jealous of uh, Super Mario 64. It looked really fun. <laughs> but here we go, we are playing Donkey Kong right now. And it seems like the home button is start. You may have to figure out the controls, but it should be pretty easy to figure out. I'm just gonna plug in my classic controller quick. Yeah, there we go. Now we're, now we're moving. So I'm not entirely sure if it is possible to play on the Wii Remote, but you can pause it by, or you can go back to the main menu of Not64 by pressing 1 and 2 at the same time. But I would suggest using um, a Wii Classic controller. I think that's the best way to play. Okay, I watched the entire cutscene, and that is, that is long. But here we are, <laughs> we're playing Donkey Kong. If, the, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and comment if you run into any issues. And subscribe and keep your eye out for a video on the channel installer. 
But anyways, I hope you enjoy playing your Nintendo 64 games, and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.